subscribe or this will happen to you. <laughs> yeah, you're not subscribed yet? Come on! Digital interviews this morning. And I've got my other interview after we have our burger. And then we're going down to the bone yard to try out this big stuff, so that should be fun. I had a little sleep earlier on, that was nice. Um, Jordan, Mark II, is busy filming on the, <laughs> the red camera. There's Tommy. Tommy's so good at Atlas Tons, he can spin them. Oh, yeah. spin yeah. them oh, yeah. Amazing. How are you feeling today? I'm feeling very good. Got a burger, but it's not five guys, it's restaurant burger. What have you got on today? What have you got on? Medical, which I failed, so I'm not doing it anymore. And I had a digitals, and I've got another interview. Then Boneyard. So, I'm a cowboy. Cowboy. How many horses do you have? Uh, none anymore. None? No. But uh, you're not a real cowboy then. <laughs> yeah. I have horses. I have a farm. Ah. You don't eat horse? No, we don't, we don't eat horse. There was a scandal in the UK that they were putting horse meat in like all the cheaper end stuff. Um, it was horse meat. Some uh, burger joint wasn't doing that? Some, some, yeah. yeah, yeah. Who's that guy? Who's that guy? Oh my god, that's Robert Everest. Are you feeling good? I'm feeling good. You know, ready to get, kill it, you know? Yes, sir. Go up against the dish. Yeah, Benny! <laughs> Best of luck to you, my man. Yeah, thank you. Are you going to smash it? Yeah, I'm going to smash Boom. it. Right, we're going to finish eating. An hour before I'm going out to do the equipment testing. Um, we can't film down there. But I believe Tom went down, smashed it. He felt pretty confident. Um, so I'm just going to do some kind of stretches and stuff just to warm up and I've got my wee, my old master, my old pro gun. Make sure I'm all nice and stretched and ready to go because we've been sitting around here now for a few days. So just critical, I think, to make sure you're, you're kind of properly warmed up because, you know, going down there and having an injury now would be devastating. So, and it wouldn't be the first time things have happened like that. So I'm just looking after myself, trying to, you know, stretch off, make sure I'm nice and limber. Go down, give the events a, a quick blast. The loading barrels are supposed to be quite big, so looking forward to kind of getting to grips with them. Pressing medley, it's a 90 kilo dumbbell, 100 kilo dumbbell, barbell and an axle. Then we've got deadlifts, fingals and the pickaxe hold as well. So we'll see how that goes. I'm gonna pop down in half an hour, get a tin of rain, get jacked up in some rain. And then yeah, just kind of see how it goes. And then we'll have some food. Do some hot and cold later, and that's the day's done. I'll go and get my go and get the sunglasses from Tom. The Terminator sunglasses, I think they're a, a must um, in the California sunshine out here. It's it's been lovely weather so far, but I think next week it's going to get up to like 43 degrees, which is going to be bonkers. All good, just a nice little chill day today. See how the boneyard gets on. So we'll update you after. Do we update with Tommy? Oh, nice. That's a big chunk of ice there. Mm-hmm. Oh, she's cold today. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Oh, that's nice. Good you want more? I'm good with this, man. You can put some more in if you want. Yeah, let's go. Let's get some more ice in this motherfucker. More ice, all right. Yeah, buddy. Kushi, I hope you're watching. This hey, is what you should be doing, but feel this one. Oh, yes, sir. Oh, oh. <laughs> that's nice. Huh? There's all the guys by the pool, just like being in Scotland. So we just had familiarisation. Barrels felt good. Anvil felt good. Did the pickups, pickaxe, front hold. That was good. Fingals good. Pressing good. Everything is good. This time just going on. <laughs> I need some more ice in here. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> That's a challenge. <laughs> I was being nice. Let's do it. Big Tom, the ice king. Tom's wanting some more. How cold can we go? So Jordan Mulligan is in the country from tomorrow evening, I believe. So our uh, Scottish friend Ruri will get some help. Much deserved help, I think, for Ruri's back, hurting. He's doing a great job capturing all the footage. It's 
is actually ex extremely nice with the warmer air the colder water feels actually quite nice comes getting more ice feels like the caribbean this feels like sydney <laughs> Now, now proper, proper ice bath? That's a proper ice bath. There we go. One more bag. Mmm, I love it when you mix the water around. It's so nice. <laughs> it's amazing. Simon, when we come home, we're going to expect you to mix our ice water. What are we eating tonight, Tommy? Steak, baby. Steak, potatoes, and macaroni balls. You like these ones, don't you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mulligan Brothers for getting this for us. Much yeah. appreciated, mate. Yeah, thank you, Mulligan Brothers. Yep, big old steak, yeah, a couple of ribeyes. Mmm. Bobby, how's things? You good? Well, I'm good. You? Yeah, man, just. How you yeah, nice, Tom, get your belly out. Yeah, breathe out, boy. Oh, there he is. Oh, hi. <laughs> this is big. Um, yesterday, like we said, we had the equipment testing. It was good just to let a bit of aggression out. Um, for me, I was needing that, needing that little kind of release, so maybe I did a little bit more than I would normally do um, at equipment testing, but I think that's the first start of the kind of the competition for me, you know, when you go in, everything feels like everything, you know, you're smashing it, you're, you're going through the, the events and making it look easy. That's you making that statement, and that's what I'm trying to do here this year, is make that statement and, and kind of prove to everyone that that's, that's why I'm here, is to, you know, to push on and, and, and be one of the top competitors this year. So today is the last day before we go into to kind of comp mode. So this is the last day of, of fun, so to speak. Um, from tomorrow, we all have a job to do. So I owe it to all the competitors out here to not mess around, to not be that guy that's bouncing about like I have been in the, in the previous years. So um, this is my job, this is my passion now you know so I've got to really grab it by both hands and, and do everything I can to to be the best athlete because I've got some amazing amazing athletes in my group you know it's it's a stacked lineup and it's an honor for me to go up against the the best guys in the world and, and do battle with them so that's what I love for this is what I do this is why I'm here to to put myself against the best in the world and um, and I think that's why everyone's here, so it's pretty awesome. So there has been a little bit of changing in the in the group's injuries and whatnot, but I can't really go into that um, until it's made official. Looking forward to seeing Jordan this evening. It's nice um, having having Jordan out because he's he gives you that little bit extra the motivation without giving us motivation, if that makes sense. So it's like you just just being in his presence kind of. Um, pushes me and inspires me to do better so that's cool comp mode now you know where i'm not on my phone all night not messaging kush because of the time difference i just give her a voice note before i go to bed um and then the same when i wake up and then she knows everything's okay and then i in turn know everything is okay back home so that's where my head has to be i can't have any distractions now it's good for me to talk and calm and talk to you guys on youtube that kind of helps me and then when i watch it back i get kind of pumped up because i see that i'm in business so yeah really excited to get going tomorrow tomorrow is game day i'm super excited so hopefully we can update you with some good news as it comes in we just received our schedule for tomorrow tom's with uh, the mile airs he's doing a little bit of that the loading medley um, I'm at 8.40, 8.30, 8.30, 830 you start. Let's That's just say 9 o'clock-ish, because you know, it's usually 20 minutes, so, so let's just say 9, Luke says half 11, so, uh, and, and then we're not, and then the second event for me is not till quarter past five, so uh, I get to switch off for a while. Yeah. So. so they do the squats first, group one, they have, that's Brian's group, so they have loading and squat, and then they're finished at 14.45. Um, and then Big Tom and I were, uh, what's it there? Um, so my start time for deadlift is 18.40 and your start time is 17.20. So we just spoke to Nathan. The group starts at that time. Yes. Yeah. So just spoke to Nathan, didn't we, about food and stuff. Um, had quite a chill day today. 
I just went asleep for about an hour and a bit. So the world's strongest man this year, um, there's a media team here, Mitch and Jesse and the guys, they update us um, with official photos that we can use so there's no um, worry about what photos we can use and what we can't. So we've actually done pretty good. So that's it, so we're going to get some food. What have we got coming tonight? A meat feast. Spaghetti, meatballs, sausages. We're going to have our last supper to together. And then Jordan is out tomorrow evening. You made a video for me, it's cool. Yeah. yeah. Just to get me pumped up. Thank you very much for that. Uh, I think it was Luke that uh, edited it. So thank you very much for that, Luke. I was in tears watching it. As you can see, my eyes are a little bit bloody. We'll maybe let you have a little look at that when we go back to the room. But we're going to do, Tom's going to finish off his recovery. We're going to do a little bit of filming for the documentary as well, which will be fun. And then we'll see you for dinner. Just heading down to the lobby for some food. Our last meal before we compete tomorrow. So Tommy's down there to snow. I'll enjoy that and then we'll do some hot and cold and then it'll be bedtime. Hi Gav, how are you doing? <laughs> oh sorry, you're not Gavin. So I was just joking, mate. Sorry. <laughs> Big Gav, we're not in the same group anymore. No, no, mate, sad, sad. I times. know I was kinda excited. Excited but scared to go up against you. I was looking forward to it, mate, yeah. yeah it would have been good. Go against yourself would have been great, mate. But yeah, obviously, you've got circumstances of Rome, so it's, Yeah. And uh, it's asked me to move, and yeah, why not? I'm here to compete. Um, yeah, good, mate. And I get to go against Brian Shaw, and that was pretty cool. Pretty cool, yeah, man, yeah. Is, mate. <laughs> I felt like I was with Brian last year, and like, just watching him and stuff, it's like you learn a lot. Uh, yeah, that's that's a great thing, because obviously, yeah, he's, he's one of the greats, if not the greatest, so yeah. to compete against him and just to, just to watch him the way he does things. Yeah. Definitely. Picking up little things this year which I wasn't catching on last year, so yeah, yeah it's just it's a bit, massive learning curve for me. But, yeah. And you're feeling good after UK, so it's yeah, good. it was a great show. It's yeah. tough, you know yourself, how, how brutal it can be. Yes, right. Um, yeah, so like, so got rid of the ring, let's knock some cobwebs off, and yeah. lucky enough, you know, I come through and skate no injuries. Um, and I'm on to the, you know, this one, now the biggest competition in the world. It's class, isn't it? It's class, good. Mate, yeah. how, is, how is your coach? Your coach is Dale, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Dale, uh, 3D strength. Yeah, he's Asian class, club. isn't he? Yeah. A, little, a little bit loose, I think, but um, <laughs> yeah, we get on really well. Yeah, he's yeah. a good f***er. Like, he's, nice. he's, he's, he's held massively in my training because I was just, I was getting stuck in the circle, I was just going round and round. I was yeah. forgetting the condition and just becoming like a, a one-trick pony because yeah, static, yeah. which is no good. And, yeah, it was, it's worked really well. I feel good, so I'm a little bit lighter than 191 this year. So skinny, skinny, yeah. Yeah, yeah abs on it, yeah. as I said before, yeah, so. Good, mate. Yeah, I just feel really good. I'm looking forward to it. I can't wait to get start to tomorrow. Yeah. I'll be shooting for you now, Drew. Yes, well. thanks very much. Cheers, mate. Yes. Thank you, lad. Oh, who's that? Is that, <laughs> oh, is that Edward Hall? Who's Edward? Oh, you, you, I don't think you can see him, but see yourself behind Gav, actually. You're, you disappear. Oh, I don't know if that's offensive to Gav or to me. I don't know, probably both, yeah. to be honest. <laughs> what, what weight are you now, Eddie? Are you... A very, a very slender 158 kilos. Is that the lightest you've been in a while, or? I'd say I haven't weighed that since, oh, like 2013, something like that. Mm. Yeah. Jeez, it's been well, a long time. You were out for a wee run earlier on? Yeah. Hitting the, hitting the, the pavement, or what? I was uh, throwing some dirt up behind me. Good, but good. We're excited. We're all excited for the fight. Not as excited as me. Oh. <laughs> Who's going to win, mate? What, the, the world or the fight? The fight. Is that even a question? <laughs> Who do you think's going to win? <laughs> yeah. So you want him to put this in and right there and do right there like this. Can we turn it over? Yeah. As soon as once you got it marked, you're good. And. Ooh. Yeah. Okay. Right, okay, so Tom, go back on, mate. All right. And then proper stretch out. So the aim is to get as long as you possibly can, yeah? You want to lock it? So put your finger, yeah, like up against the... There you go, right there, right there, right there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A little, there you go, a little right there, perfect. Yeah. 82, yeah. 82. I wish you good luck for tomorrow. Thank you, good luck you too. Thank you, I appreciate it. I say good luck for the case. for... Stung off. <laughs> yeah, I prepare for every aspect. Great. <laughs> Good luck for tomorrow, man. Let's do it. Can't wait. Excited. It, Privilege to compete against you, mate. Yeah, it's it's uh, blast. It's going to be fun, man. I'm excited. Yeah, yeah, man. Good. Let's go. It's about 9 p.m. Um, just did some hot and cold. Quick blast in my leg sleeves. Some of the massage gun. Give Kush a lot of fun. And then 
It's off to bed we go. I think we're leaving about half eight tomorrow morning. Loading race first, that should be fun. We'll just try and keep you updated. Tom's going to come over in a wee second, so we'll see him when he comes over. So we'll chat to you in a little second. Hey dude, what have you been up to tonight? What you have for dinner? I had meatballs, spaghetti and sausage. And we have got pancakes ready to go for comedy. Earlier start for me, I'll be leaving here about Half six, seven, I'm not leaving early, you know, pointless leaving too early, it's loading at the end of the day, mm. you know, you don't need to uh, mach around on bars and stuff, so it's literally just going to try and stay as late as I can in the hotel and then go out, so mm. yeah, but we'll see what, we'll just play it by ear tomorrow, nice and chilled, nice and relaxed. So. All set for the day. Excited for tomorrow, and then um, that'll be that, so thank you very much for all the support messages, we appreciate it. Thank you very much guys, so remember it's two events a day, one in the morning, one at night, and we will update you when we get back from each day. So, so thank you very much guys, watch the same. Stay safe, smile and stay spicy. And please keep ringing that little bell. Ding -a -ling -a -ling -a -ling.